and they're back up at um, Cassie Art Golf Course. Three days after I last came and look at these. I pulled a, I pulled a few of these, whatever these sort of like hinge mushrooms. I thought they were a hinge mushroom because they were sort of like going outside of the wall. Check out that to the size of my hand. Bird bath. And I also, there's quite a few of them around and they're deteriorating really fast. Look. Look how they compost. Would have found some parasols over here. Which I know are safe to eat, so they're getting in my basket. Pause. And action. This is actually a false parasol, right? And I'll tell you how I know the difference. Can you see the middle bit on the top? It'll be a little bit protruding on a parasol mushroom. And also, if you look at the stem, you see the stem's smooth. A normal parasol mushroom, it'll sort of like have like a, like a thin, they call it like a snaky skin thing. It, it looks a little bit like bark off a tree. Now they do give tummy upsets to a small majority of people, these, so if you are going to try them, make sure you're 100%, 110% do your research and do a field test, do a taste test, do all the tests that you need to do to identify them and then, you know, you're just safe to have a munch. There's a couple more there, they're coming as well. And scene.